Minister Kehli Rambukwella and former State Printing Corporation Chairman Jayampati Bandara Heen Kendra have been charged by the Bribery Commission under the Bribery Act over the alleged misuse of public funds. In a display of public outrage, civil organizations launched a Satyagraha today outside the Criminal Investigation Department, demanding the immediate arrest of former Health Minister Kehliya Rambukwella over his alleged involvement in the recent pharmaceutical scandal. Protesters were urging the authorities to deliver justice. Sanjay Mahabatta blocked the entrance of the CID and engaged in a protest. The police opposed this move. This was filed on the 30th of November. We came here early morning yesterday with President's Council Maitri Gunaratna. He asked to meet the director of the CID. The director is afraid to meet us. He is afraid that we will ask what happened to the complaint we filed. Tomorrow is the court date. We now have this drug scam and rituximab scam. If this is done today, there will be a huge issue. However, we are not afraid. <laughs> Later, Sanjay Mahavatta was granted the opportunity to enter the CID premises. According to a complaint filed by our organization with the Criminal Investigation Department regarding the hemoglobin fraud, a case has been filed today in the Maliga Kanda court and currently seven suspects have been arrested. But despite all the evidence, former Health Minister Kehele Rambukwala is the mastermind behind this. Instead of arresting him, the Criminal Investigation Department is ignoring it entirely. There was an attempt to intentionally kill over 25,000 people in the country by administering substance standard human immunoglobulin as a cancer treatment. This group attempted to commit genocide in the country by letting diseases such as HIV and hepatitis spread among the people. We hope at least now, those responsible for these murders and the economic downfall will be brought to justice. The immunoglobulin scandal is not a regular scandal. This is a scandal which unveiled thousands of scams and the technical mafia within the mechanism of the health service. We did not see more than one of these people being captured. Is this company a sole proprietorship? There is one name in the tender. That person has not even been questioned so far. We know very well that within Sri Lanka, constitutional system, written evidence is lost through the absence of a formal system for a minister to give orders to a secretary. We need to know the former health minister's involvement in the human immunoglobulin scandal and if he received any orders from above, who gave him the orders. In the midst of the ongoing legal challenges surrounding the Bribery Commission case, Minister Kehli Rambukwello offered an explanation for his absence at a scheduled Criminal Investigation Department meeting today. Rambukwello stated that he was required to attend court proceedings related to a separate case in the Colombo High Court. He also said that he had a scheduled meeting at the President's Secretariat to participate in the Public Expenditure Management Ministerial Subcommittee.